Hey everybody, Dr. Seth Labbitt with the Cafe of Life Chiropractic Center in Mill Valley, California. This month in the office we've been talking about upper extremity issues. We're actually calling it falling apart syndrome. So for upper extremity, most people um, understand we're talking about the shoulder. So there's all various different types of shoulder injuries that you can have. You can have a rotator cuff injury, you can have an impingement injury, you can have a labral tear, all different kinds of things with the shoulders. For the elbow, we have uh, you know golfer's elbow, we have tennis elbow, for the wrist, carpal tunnel, all different types of issues that we're dealing with with the upper extremity. Wanted to just go over one helpful, one helpful tip for you guys when dealing with upper extremity, when we're dealing with tennis elbow or golfer's elbow, we wanna work the wrist extensors in through here. So obviously, we're using these wrist extensors quite a bit when we're typing, when we're on our phones all the time. So these are foam rollers in through here. I'm just gonna go over a quick little demonstration of the foam roller. This is a new foam roller that I have. I love this foam roller. It's called the proper foam roller. And as you can tell, it's got a natural groove in the middle. It's ergonomically designed to protect your osseous structures and your spine, so I really enjoy it. It also has these contour 3D bumps on it to get into the soft tissue. So let me show you what it looks like. If you put this down over here and you take your wrist extensors, you can fit it right into the groove over here, and you're just gonna start to work some of these wrist extensors in through here. So working the muscles, working the fascia, right into these wrist extensors, that's very helpful. The other thing that you can do is you can work in through your posterior shoulder and through here. And again, with this natural groove, it makes it that much easier to get in and to protect the osseous structures in through here. So rolling in and rolling, getting into that posterior shoulder in through here, right there, posterior shoulder. So really helpful. I could feel that really getting in there. I love this foam roller because of the contour and how it protects things. This is another one in through here. You know, it's convenient travel size, but it's really knobby in through here, and I find that it's a little aggressive. This one in through here is bigger, super dense, and it gets in, but it doesn't get in quite as good, and I just like the feel of this proper foam roller. The ergonomic design seems to work really well. The density is really good, too. It's pretty dense, but not too dense. So anyway, hope this has been helpful and I look forward to connecting with you next time. Make sure to check in with us here at the office. We're constantly pumping out information, giving to you guys about how you can be on top of these various different types of conditions. This month, upper extremity falling apart syndrome. So thanks so much, look forward to connecting with you soon.